passengers who are out of patience, delayed flights and long security lines. But if you need a moment of zen, the next time you're at Sky Harbor, seek out some painting and photography. Allison Snell reports how the airport museum has arrived at a milestone. When we think of Phoenix Sky Harbor Airport, we mostly think of travel, but for the last 30 years, Phoenix Sky Harbor has grown an art collection from less than 20 to more than 900 works of art. I got a close look today at some of the pieces and the stories behind them. Inspiring, it gives you ideas. Jody Rosen is from St. Martin in the Caribbean and is heading to California. She's one of over 40 million people a year who go through Sky Harbor Airport giving the exhibit lots of exposure to travelers. Oh, I think it's fabulous. I love, I'm an artist, so I love art. Rosen related most to the survivalist home sweet home piece after 30 years of living in an area that faces destructive hurricanes. We look at survival and we pack up things. This is the 30th anniversary of the Phoenix Airport Museum and Gary Martelli has been a part of it for the past 20. Our mission is to promote Arizona's unique artistic and cultural heritage. They feature Arizona icons like the Grand Canyon and the saguaro cactus. And it gives them a window into what Arizona is like. And, and we have this huge 26-foot Dan Naminga painting that has been in storage, and we were able to bring it out and put it on the back wall, and I know it's drawing people in. I love the idea of art in unexpected places. They have a variety of art, from paintings to sculptures to pieces done entirely in colored pencil. It's approachable, art is for everyone. For some, the art exhibit in the airport inspires them for their own art. After collecting jewels from yearly carnivals in the Caribbean, Rosen made what she calls Carnival Girl. After seeing the pieces in the collection, she plans on taking that inspiration home with her. Because that's what I'll do in the next few weeks is my art. This exhibit will be in the Phoenix Sky Harbor Terminal 4 until June 2019. In the Broadcast Center, Allison Snell, Cronkite News.